Magic Kid. This book is called Supergirl at Superhero High by Lisa Gay. And I have reviewed like some other books that are still in the same series as these. And I really, really like these books because it's like, I'm a superhero! I'm a superhero! I'm going on a superhero adventure! And I think Lisa he is really good at doing that and even just picturing stuff in your mind. Like, if you just read a, um, a picture book and you don't look at the pictures, you're like, huh? I don't get it. But in this one, she has so much, like, context clue. So it's like, instead of just, I don't get it, it's, ooh, I love this video. It's like, actually like a movie playing in your mind, like, and it's like kind of except their sound too kind of because they like, people talk so that's really cool about Lisa Yee's books and um the story like the plot of this book is Supergirl's planet gets crushed and then she arrives on Earth a couple of days later, she um, gets superpowers. Superpowers! Like, no, she can do heat vision, microscopic vision, um, telescopic vision, um, x ray vision, like, blasters of heat out of her, her eyes, flight, strength. She has lots of stuff and speed too. So she's getting these powers faster than her fellow Kryptonian, Superman. And afterward, she notices she gets to go to Superhero High. And she doesn't want to go to Superhero High. She thinks that she's not good enough. Like her powers are uncontrolled. She, like, sometimes there might be, like, her powers may be a mess. So she needs to go to Superhero High to control those powers. But Supergirl thinks, well, at Superhero High, I'm not going to match. But Supergirl? Huh, like, before that, her name is Kara. Now listen how she names herself. Well, her fellow Kryptonian Superman is Superman. And she's like, well, if he's my fellow Kryptonian, I should name myself Supergirl. And now Supergirl is Supergirl. And then Supergirl goes and she watches a ton of videos about Superhero High. And then she also sees Wonder Woman. She's really fond of Wonder Woman. And then she comes to Superhero High and then she goes through a lot of stuff. And then these theories. Actually, Granny Goodness is their librarian. Listen to that. Granny Goodness. Now the last part. Goodness. It says good. Yes, no. She's actually needs a ton of furies, and they want to battle and take over Earth. And they want to make everybody on the good side be on the bad side. And that's what they really want. They want that to happen to everybody. But Supergirl is trying really hard, and then she gets these earrings. Like, so, um, that Barbara Gordon isn't that. Okay, so Barbara Gordon um needs and she is very good with, very good with tech high tech and she says i need a crystal and supergirl knows that there's a crystal on her necklace that's a special crystal and whenever she touches it it shines when somebody evil touches it it turns dark black and like um, Grim and Goodness did that, but Supergirl didn't notice. So. And then she says, well, I'll give you the crystal on my necklace. And she says, okay, but your mother gave you this. And she's like, well, the world needs it more than I do, because otherwise nobody it wouldn't happen. So, like, everybody would be working for the fairies. So then she got, so, so she needs to, um, like she needs to go out and make everybody on the good side again but it's gonna take forever so that girl says 
Supergirl comes back and says, Well, I need a you need a bigger crystal. So Batgirl's like, the amethyst works. Supergirl's, uh-huh. The amethyst does work. So they need to cause a distraction. So they so the Furies won't see Barbara Gordon plugging the make make people nice electricity thing plug into the crystal the amethyst the top of superhero high. superhero high so supergirl gets these earrings that will make her even if she even if she all, is almost if she even if the so here's how she does it. the amethyst comes and if if supergirl even if she does get made into a fury she won't because her earrings are special. Those earrings are special. Barbara gave them to her. And after that, like they win and yay, yay. They win. So then, they go inside and she finds big Brenda, I think. And she uh, lives for the um, rules the Furies helps Granny goodness, but she's putting stuff that's been knocked over in battle back, like the superheroes artwork and stuff back. That's not. But then she gives superhero Supergirl her her crystal from her necklace back, and then she has to go back into the portal so she can go back to the Furies world. And then that's kind of where the book ends, actually. Well, then Supergirl becomes Hero of the Month. And hero of the Month means you're a special hero and get to show the new student around. The new student this time is Batgirl. Da na 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 Batgirl! So, what it is, is first Wonder Woman. First, it's the, it's the Wonder Woman book. And that's like a separate book. Or Bumblebee book. But I don't know. And then there's Supergirl, and then there's Batgirl, and then there's Katana. So that's, I know that because each time a new student enters, and you can match those. That's like a puzzle. That's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time on a Maya the Science Kid video. Sock! Sock!